Talk about this game then and, and getting minutes. Obviously, you're disappointed that the, the reserve game was on turf, so you didn't get to play. But uh, So talk about uh, you know your involvement uh, in D.C. and uh, trying to help this team get a win. You know, that's what I will, um, will try to do. Uh, if the coach wants me on the pitch, I'll try to do as hard as I can to uh, get a win because we need it. And it's a, it's a hard place. I've been there two times now. We still haven't won there. So uh, hopefully we're going to do it Saturday. So what were, what was the illness? You were sick. It wasn't the back. You were. Did you have a virus? Something like that. Yeah. Okay. I was just yeah. I've been in bed for two days, so and I had some little bit of a fever, so I wasn't feeling too well. But I don't want to miss any more games, so I had to come in today. Today I still don't feel great, but I had the training and so go home, get some rest, and uh, then hopefully. Uh, get some minutes Saturday and try to get a win. If you had to start, could you start? Uh, you know, you don't. the team could always be in a situation where it might not be uh, the best move tactically to bring you in late, depending on what's gone on in the game. Would you prefer to, to start or to be able to come in as a sub? I always want to start. Uh, start. Of course, that's what you want as a player. But uh, for now, uh, I'm just still still just getting back from, uh, from a long-term injury. So uh, I just had my first... 10 minutes, including uh, stoppage time against Philly. So any minute I'm going to get, I'm happy with. And the longer, the better. A lot of times when, when people come back from injuries, at least when they're a bit younger in their 20s, maybe they say they feel a lot better. Um, how do you feel compared to maybe when you went down to, to compared to now? Same? Is it, is it better? You feel fine. I feel, I feel great. I feel ready to play again. So I feel good. Can you tell in practice, Danny, if you're feeling sharp, you know, if, uh, if you're on firing at all cylinders, or do you really have to wait until you're in a game? Uh, you know, you can still play a really bad game and score a goal, but, uh, yeah, you, you never, you, can, you can't tell. You, you never know. Sometimes you, ha sometimes you have the feeling that, you know, there's a game coming and the one chance is going to be the goal. So uh, hopefully that comes really fast. But for now, I just can't tell. Today, I felt fine in training, so. This break uh, that the team's had, was it good or bad? Would you rather have been able after Philadelphia to get playing as soon as possible, or was the break uh, good for you? No, I wanted to play, of course, because it's another uh, yeah, missed opportunity to play. There was the reserve game, which I couldn't play because of the turf, but uh, I wish we would have had a, a league game. That would have been better. Football can be a, a cruel business, uh, as you know. One of your friends was waived today, Terry Dunfield. Uh, uh, the coach said it was it was business, salary cap, roster. Uh, obviously, you're sad to see him uh, see him go. Any thoughts about that move? I'm gonna miss him, of course. But uh, yeah, it's uh, it's sad, and uh, I think the coach said it. it it's business, so uh, yeah. Sometimes it's uh, it, it's tough, and you know what can I say? I wish he was he still was here, but uh, he isn't, and uh, I wish him all the best in the future. And uh, maybe I can talk to him today. Can you uh, just one more question on that? He was quite a character. I'm sure he provided something in the locker room for this team. Can you talk a little bit about what he was like? <laughs> he is just a great guy, a funny guy, and uh, he was important for the team. And uh, yeah, I, I, what can I say? I'm going to miss him and. Uh, it's sad it turned out like this, but you know uh, what the coach said, it's, uh, it's business, so I can't do anything about it, unfortunately. Will we, will we see you on any turf fields this year? I'm, I'm not sure if how many how many turf games you guys have remaining to. Two left. Will we, is that like a mental block thing for you, or is that something that you might think you, uh, you can play on in the future? Here? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm never afraid to go on turf, but I think just because I'm just, I just got back, we just wanted to take it easy, and there's a turf game coming up in Portland and in Boston again, so I'm not saying I'm never going to play on turf anymore. Danny, when we used to ask you about uh, the goals you scored, you never really, you just said you like you were happy that they went in, you didn't really care what they, they looked like. When the next one goes in, are you going to be a little happier? Yeah, of course, because it's been a while. <laughs> it's been a while since I scored one, so... A little happier, but I still have the same feeling. It doesn't matter how it goes in, off my shoulder, off my nose. As long as it goes in, it goes in. It's a goal.